morning, amigos. Dr. Doug here. Found an interesting article I want to share with you. It's from James Cook University in Australia. Here's the here's the lead. Does fast food contribute to depression? Can a healthy diet combat mental illness? So these are the results that the researchers were paid to find. And they, they tried very hard to find that. But actually all they found was a link between processed food and depression. They didn't find any cause, any causal link, just a statistical link. Let me explain what, what went on. There's two islands. One is busy, lots of business, lots of working, lots of poverty, and lots of depression. Gee, I think there's a coincidence. And lots of fast food outlets. On the other island, this is a Tory Strait Islander group, the other island, there are no fast food, not much business. People mainly on island B, they ate seafood, fish. So the contention is that eating fish helps with depression because they didn't have much depression. They had some, but not a lot. Island A had more depression and people ate fast food. Well, of course, I don't see it that way. You know, fast food, I eat fast food, but usually I like to eat at home because I don't want to eat and run. I don't want to be distracted when I'm eating, but I'll eat it, you know, if I'm out, I'm hungry, whatever. Fast food, in order to sell food, restaurants, all restaurants, not just McDonald's, they load it up with survival tastes, sweet, salty, and fatty. Those are survival tastes. Well, those foods also are very good at stimulating dopamine in the brain. Bing. That feeling you eat, you get when you put something in your mouth that's delicious and swallow it. Uh, probably a lot more sweet, salty, and fatty than fish. And people who are depressed need dopamine. I mean, they need some kind of happy stimulation because they're not getting it in their lives. That's my take. It's completely backwards from either the scientists or the science writers. I never know which. They're probably all the same. So, yeah, eat fish, but don't eat fish for depression. <laughs> for depression, go back into your childhood with counseling and find out where it came from. Where did it originate? Face your demons. Solve the issues. Make peace with whoever tormented you. And also learn to stop worrying. Stop worrying about the future. You can handle whatever comes down. You need to learn that. You need to unlearn the habit of worrying and learn to depend on yourself. You do that, of course, with body trust. Oh well, that's all the preaching for today. Have a great day, amigos. Hasta luego. Hello, amigos. Please subscribe to my show and share it with your friends. Also, Click that little bell so that you will receive notice every time I post a new episode.